Hi everybody and welcome to the channel of Gust. Today I'm going to tell you some things about owning a Chow Chow. Gust is with us for about four months now. For some reason the Chow Chow, they don't listen very well. They just do what they want to do. If you yell at them, if you call them for, to come over, most of the time he just won't do it. If you give him treats, he'll do everything, but just for about a few minutes, not much longer. For the maintenance of the coat, we brush Gust about three times a week. If you brush him for about three times a week for 15-20 minutes, his fur will always be nice and shiny. And if your breeder does a good job, he's already used to being brushed. Then when it comes to barking, Gust only will bark when there are strangers at the door. He will bark if people come inside and he will bark for about 2-3 minutes and then he will leave you alone. He comes sniffing around, looking who is over here, but nothing much. Gust, he doesn't like our cat. For 3 months it's really the story of a lifetime like cats and dogs. Gust always chases our cat. The cat, she doesn't mind it, but she also doesn't like it. She, if they can, she will avoid him and run away. For the kids, Gust is his best friend. He really loves the kids. He wants to play with them, be with them. Wherever the kids are, Gust is. He likes to play with the ball, with the toy. The Chow Chow, they're not made to sleep in a bench. So if Gust at night, he can sleep wherever he wants in the house. He will always stay downstairs with the back door open. So if he wants to go outside, he can go outside. If he wants to stay inside, he'll stay inside. Gus is free to move around the house. I want to thank everybody for watching the channel. And please subscribe if you want to see more movies about Gus or funny facts about the Chow Chow. Thank you very much for watching, please subscribe and hit the notification bell.